Welcome back to Biafra News Support Biafra People of Goodwill. Ada Biafra here. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening to you, depending on where you're watching me from. Biafra friends, I bring you another update. Coming from Biafra Prime Minister Mazza Samone as official ex -ado. This very news headline is from Ponche News and Biafra Prime Minister posted it. Labwaja has joined the the crying league of, uh, should I say crying club, like Biafra Prime Minister said. Labwaja has uh, joined the crying club of uh, Musa lamenting how uh, troops operate how troops operate on that difficult environment hmm? this is just the beginning they haven't seen anything they thought southeast will, will always be easy for them to do as they please no southeast is no longer gone are the days they did whatever they want they dance the python their pythons or should i say the pythons they deployed to southeast danced as they wish to or as they wanted and nobody challenged them not now anymore they, 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 the pythons are no longer dancing they, they are falling they are falling every day on daily basis and they'll keep falling until they are all flushed out of biafra land so dear friends i'm bringing you this very update from biafra prime minister the news headline is from punch news and it says uh, most troops operate under difficult uh, environment says uh, coas that's Lagwaja. before i continue i would like to welcome all the new and old subscribers if you're coming across my channel for the first time Please kindly click the red subscribe button, turn on the notification bell right beside it to enable you get notification once I upload a new video. Don't forget to share, like, leave your comments at the comment section. So, dear friends, pay attention as we as we continue with this very update. So, uh, Langwaja is indirectly telling you that those on Ventan Boko Haram that are deploying to South East are receiving what the what promise. They always like to hide the truth. But we are here to debunk their lies and tell them the truth that they are scared of. He said most uh, troops operate under difficult environment, says uh, says uh, zoo terrorist uh, killers in army uniform, uh, Lagwaja. Soldiers, uh, the time they danced in Southeast Operation Python dance and all of that, and they killed as many as they can, nobody challenged them. Gone at those days. Their friends are defending themselves and their land. And we are not hiding it from the world. We have been killed. We have been terrorized. We have been marginalized. Properties of beer friends have been destroyed. Old mothers and fathers has been crying over their properties and their buildings that have been set ablaze by Nigeria army. For what exactly? Because beer friends want to be free. We no longer want to be part of Nigeria. That is why they unleashing all these uh, terrorism on beer friends. And the gallant men came out and said, enough is enough. It's time for us to defend our land. And they are doing that without looking back. That is why both Lagbaja and Musa are busy crying up and down. You can't keep terrorizing people in their own land and expect them to fold their hands. You can't keep killing people in their own land and expect them to fold their hands and keep watching you people. You can't set buildings ablaze for no reason and expect them to fold their hands and watch you. Soldiers are being killed in the north. They are being ambushed and killed in the north. But nobody is talking about that. You people always sweep it under the carpet because it's the Fulani food soldiers you people imported from other African countries that are ambushing Nigeria tourist soldiers and killing them in the north. But in Southeast, once anything is if one uh, the, the, the youth or a community resist the soldiers, you see them throwing in setting the village ablaze, setting the community ablaze, but you can't see them do something in the north. So, why should they be allowed in Southeast to carry out all these uh, out of terrorism and expect the people to fold their hands and watch them? Where is that being done? Well, we must continue. So here, the news headline says, uh, most troops operate under difficult environment, says uh, uh, Lagwaja. What we have not heard, the soldiers, you people are sending to Zabisa Forest and still, you know, leaking their information to the uh, uh, bandit to attack them. We have not heard you people lament about that. You people always cry about those uh, unrepentant Boko Harams that have been said to Southeast, how they have been neutralized. You people always cry out about it. So what are they doing in Southeast? Sometimes they, whenever they tell you 10 is, uh, is uh, 100, oh. so no doubt and no peace. So here, Biafra Prime Minister posted under this very uh, news headline and said, Labwaja, joined the, Labwaja has joined the crying club of uh, Musa. The COAS admitted that most of the troops were operating under a very difficult and uh, challenging environment, expressing the need to live up to the demanding of the calling. Okay. He said the government had the interest of the soldiers at heart by investing on their operation and well-being. Oh, really? Ah, we didn't know. <laughs> Sending them to South is to look for what is not looking for them is the government having their interest at heart. What exactly are they looking for in South East? They can't tell you. They should go to the north where they are needed. 
These people are needed in the north, but you will not see them in the north. Go to the north where you're needed. Farmers are calling, um, uh, are calling for Nigeria army and the Nigeria government to come to their rescue. That they are being killed in their own land. They are being terrorized. Their farm uh, uh, crops have been destroyed. The same thing they were doing in Biafra land now until they, they were all resisted. But uh, they will not go because their main target is how to take over Southeast. But they told you that Southeast is landlocked. Is that not what they told you? Oh, Southeast is landlocked. Southeast is, Southeast is dot in a circle. But they are still looking for a way to take over Southeast. Will that work? No, it can never work. Biafra land belongs to Biafrans. And Biafran gallant men are out to defend their land, protect the lives and properties of Biafrans, so that Nigeria can no longer come to Biafra land and set their buildings ablaze and go unchallenged. They can no longer come to Biafra land, kill as many as they can, and go unchallenged. Gallant men are defending Biafra land, and we are not hiding it from the world. That is what the world told us to do. When we cry to them, to come to our rescue, they said they said we should go and defend ourselves, and that is what our gallant men are doing. Whenever you hear them talk about this, just know that is the water water promise they are receiving in Biafra land. Just know that, because the python can no longer dance in Biafra land. The python can no longer dance. Hmm? They have not seen anything. They never see anything yet. This is just the beginning. When they were conducting operation this and that, crocodile dance, python dance. It was very easy for them, but now, no, it's not. It's no longer that. It's no longer that easy for them. Python dance environment was uh, conducive. Hmm? When they were doing Python dance, crocodile dance, environment was very, very conducive for them. But because Biafra Prime Minister Mazda Simon provided adequate security to protect Biafrans, environment are no longer conducive for them. Water, water continues. Our Biafra land will swallow them all, all of them, swallow all of them. All of them. Hmm? Biafra land will swallow all of them. They will keep getting what they are looking for. That thing they are looking for in Biafra land, they will keep saying it. They should go to the north where they are needed. But no, you'll see them coming to Biafra land. The environment is no longer conducive. Oh, really? When they were doing python dance, crocodile dance, everything was very conducive. It's no longer conducive for them now. They haven't seen anything. This is just the beginning. They know, they now know that their troops are in difficult environment in Biafra land. They are just realizing that. But in the north, they live cool in barracks with, uh, with, with, confro with a confronting uh, Boko Haram, but uh, confronting the Afrali Russian army uh, uh, and, and they feel the heat. Hmm? They haven't seen anything. They haven't seen anything. This is just the beginning. They will keep receiving with the, with the promise because gallant men are fully out to defend Biafra land, protect lives and properties of Biafrans. We will not allow them to arise us in Biafra land, set buildings ablaze in Biafra land, and go on challenge anymore. That is what Biafra Galant men are out for. And they have forgotten that Volunteer Army can never be defeated. You can never defeat Volunteer Army. That is one thing they have failed to understand. So, Biafrans, I will stop here and read some comments, a few comments from Biafrans on this very Biafra Prime Minister Mazda Simon was a post. He said, somebody said, Weto, we have. 100,000, uh, we have 1,000 powers. We are only using one, and uh, Lagwaja is already crying. Okay, oh. now wow, now only uh, in Daboski we are using, and there is a uh, uh, lamentation everywhere. <laughs> we never use uh, Gandus. <laughs> okay, oh. Uh, we haven't used Gandusa. Oh, our friends are very funny, seriously. Another person said, Bridget Simon, but keep up the good work. The killing, the killings by AK forty seven. Uh, Totten terrorist said hard full and headsmen did not do the job because uh, job because of water water by Biafra resistance fighters. Now Ad Bukaram in Nigeria military uniform are complaining about water water from Biafra Liberation Army. Another person said Nigeria Army are not fighting in any other place aside in Biafra land. Let them hands up and they say that the firepower of the Biafra angels no be here. They should just tell Nigerians and the Fulanese that this is not 1967 1970 that Biafra angels have defeated them. Okay. We must continue. We must continue. They haven't seen anything. This is just the beginning. They haven't seen anything. So another person said, okay, another person said, Piaba Piaba Fire Jokandia. How could they leave their country and invade Biafra? Yeah, Biafra land, then think it won't be difficult for them. Musa said it's their uh, area and they grew up there. Yes, of course. Everyone knows the terrorists invaded a wrong uh, nation. 
okay another person said i love seeing them cry and frustrated <laughs> okay we must continue Beer friends are happy with the way our gallant men are dealing with those that came to kill beer friends in their own land. They are receiving what they do. Another person said, our chief will keep doing it for us. He said, he said, he said. Another person said, they never see anything. I blame those mumu where they go. Where, okay, where they go die for Nigeria. Okay, another person said, they go explain tire. Another person said, beer fry is a spirit that no one can stop or catch. Exactly. We keep telling them that and they keep proving stubborn. The more they come, the more the media end. And another person said they will continue to cry as long as my Ebo Galant PM is consigned. There will be there will be nothing. There will be okay. There will not be any conducive environment for the Zuta race and uniform in Biafra land. Ebo. Okay. Another person said they will continue to meet their end in Biafra land. All right. Another person said soon and very soon we are going to hear the cry of uh, uh, Shetima, the zoo. Nigeria is gone. Hmm. Faga ahu nketro biati. Hmm. Faga na akoka ni. And they they are already hearing it. They are already hearing it. So, dear friends, our gallant men are doing the needful. Our gallant men are doing the needful. And the chukwu kika biama will continue to guide and protect them for us. He will continue to guide and protect them for us. Give them victory in all fronts against the enemies coming to kill Biafrans in their own land. We have made it clear, unity is not by force. Biafrans want to visit Nigeria. Lugar said 100 years. And after 100 years, any group or tribe that wants to visit, they are free to do so. We, the indigenous people of Biafra, have decided not to remain in Nigeria where we are being killed, where we are being terrorized, where our buildings and properties have been destroyed. We want to visit. We cried to the world before now. They said we should go and defend ourselves. And that we, we, that is what we are doing. That is what Biafra Galant men are doing. And we are not hiding it. We are not hiding the defense of Biafra land. They will keep crying. As long as they are coming to Biafra land, to terrorize Biafrans, they will keep crying and they will keep meeting their end. So that is it, Biafrans. May Chukwu Kikabima continue to guide and protect our Galant men and give them victory in all fronts against the enemies of Biafrans and the enemies of freedom. Is said. May Chukwu Kikabiyama give them courage to continue with the great work they are doing in Biafra land. Victory in all fronts. May the ghosts of Biafra land be with them. May our ancestors guide and protect them for us. Give them victory in all fronts. Ise. 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 So Biafrans, don't forget, 29, 30, 31st, is sit at home and make sure you cast your vote. Thank you all. And don't forget, 30th is Biafra Heroes Day. Thank you all. <music>